everyone, it's Salia and this will be some kind of vlog thingy again and just telling you guys what is going on and all that and what I've been up to and yeah, what I want to update you guys about is that I'm having my driving lessons right now. I started this week and it was pretty um, nerve-wracking <laughs> at the beginning but now it's it's just going better and better so it's good it's going slowly though since i don't own a car and we don't have a car at the house either so i only have the chance to practice driving at like the driving lessons so yeah we'll see how that goes but for now i still have quite a lot of lessons during the week so i'm hoping it's gonna go faster and faster and i can't wait to actually buy a car as well but i'm, I'm still saving up for that and Oh, all that stuff, a lot of money. Yeah, and the lessons were a lot of money as well, so that kind of sucks. <laughs> That's also the reason why I didn't uh, buy that much at the Made in Asia convention, except for like posters, but you know, posters aren't that much money, and I usually spend way more on these conventions, although I, I even saved for this convention and I didn't uh, spend that much. Um, so that already explains like I have I had to buy so much for like the driver's license and the lessons and all that. So um, yeah, it takes up a lot of my time and uh, a lot of my money. So I can't really buy like DVD boxes or manga or stuff like that, which can also be a good thing since I, I still have a lot of manga that I haven't read yet. I still have that... Uh, slam dunk manga i haven't started it yet so you know i i should be reading that <laughs> i also have like the gto manga on my tablet that i do have to read since um i i have to be done reading it for manga pod um later on so and that's gonna take me a while as well because I'm, I'm just such a slow reader everything goes so slow with me and I think you've noticed that from my Bakuman reviews as well. Actually, um, for Bakuman, I finished four, so still need to make my review on that. But, you know, I really enjoyed it and I want to read five already. <laughs> but I'm the kind of person, no, you have to make your review first and then you can read more. So I have that kind of rule for myself. Otherwise, I would just keep on reading, kind of forget what happens in this one and then i'll just have to like look through and make notes and all that and now it's kind of still fresh in my mind and i can actually talk about it but um yeah that will be for another time because i will still have to write things down <laughs> for this review since a lot does happen in this manga and there's a lot of dialogue text so it did take me a while to finish volume four but um it was awesome nonetheless i really enjoyed it and yeah like i said i can't wait to read more um so yeah for manga <laughs> um it's only been this one and i've wanted to read more nanatsu no taizai but still haven't um i did start reading full metal alchemist since you know i just missed the series so i just wanted to read it again so i started reading that again um and then there's still so much that i have to catch up on and why did i start so many manga series like i know i don't read that much so why did i do this to myself uh yeah <laughs> that's my problem with manga i i don't read that much the only times i read is like when i'm only watching seasonals and nothing extra so i kind of have to wait for stuff or when I'm on the roads and I just need something to keep me busy on the train or whatever. And then I read a lot. But <laughs> it doesn't ha happen like that often. So, And I try to read on my breaks at work. But that doesn't really work either. Since my colleagues just, they, they like to chat. I like to chat as well. So we just keep talking instead of yeah doing our own stuff. So yeah, anyways. That's, that's enough about manga. So um manga nothing much so for anime though i've been in my romance mood again so um i'm almost finished with special a which i've been watching for a long time now as well um the first half just took me a long time since it wasn't boring but it was just like comedy and friendship and not too much development and now since i'm like 
past episode 10 or 11 I think it is it got way more exciting way more development and there's a lot of romance actually between all of the characters so it's gotten way more exciting and <laughs> yeah I'm gonna finish that project tonight <laughs> so I'm pretty excited about that I'm happy that I actually ended up loving it since I wasn't too sure at the beginning and then I also finished Say I Love You the anime but the thing is I've read everything that was in the anime so yeah that's that's manga again so I just need to uh, read more of that so but um yeah about the anime I prefer the manga for Say I Love You it's just way more intense and yeah I don't know maybe it is because I started with the manga and then I watched the anime not too sure but I think it's it's missing something I think the manga is way more passionate as well and it feels more honest like the conversations that some of them have and they also kind of like change stuff up in the anime and cut some stuff out of it as well so yeah I still prefer the manga but the anime is really good and sweet as well so like it too although I thought the ending was kind of like <laughs> weird it was like a random episode and it didn't really feel like a true end for me um but then again the manga is still going on so yeah you have that so yeah for that uh i'm thinking i didn't really finish other anime but then again i'm talking about this week so <laughs> that's what i finished this week um and i i'm at 120 for hunter x hunter and i'm just i'm <laughs> kind of scared because 120 there's like 148 episodes so I only have 28 episodes left and it's it's not much it's gonna be over so soon but I have a lot of live reactions left as well so it's gonna take me a while to finish that then since I have to record like almost every single episode well I don't have to but there's a few that people promise me like you will love this one and your reaction will be priceless um stuff like that so <laughs> yeah um, oh yeah, I finished Shigatsu because like your light in April, it finished yesterday, I think, and it was just lovely. And I, I liked, I actually liked the ending. I'm not gonna spoil anything for people who have not seen it. I liked the ending. I'm glad how they did it and what happened. I'm just glad it, it is that way. And we we don't have any questions left, not really. And it's not like they have to make a second season. They could do it. But I think it's fine for now. For like the first season. They ended up doing it great. I mean <laughs> I don't have any complaints to be honest. Um, so yeah it was a very lovely and emotional episode. Although I didn't cry since you know I don't really cry with stuff like that. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. It was really emotional and really touching. It was the same with like um, 160. No. 100. 16 of Hunter x Hunter was also very emotional, but I didn't cry either and I was like, what's wrong with me? I want to cry with these episodes since it's so emotional, but it just doesn't happen. So <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'm just thinking too much about like what's going to happen and all that or maybe I'm just too focused. I don't I don't know that doesn't even make sense. But yeah, anyways, um, another thing I wanted to tell you is um, you know that uh, <laughs> figure that I had from Light Yagami from a Death Node. I unboxed it. I, d I didn't do it on a uh, video but I have it right here so I can show you. I actually showed it in my Dead Parade uh, video as well since we kind of saw a reference of that Node in there. Anyways my figure kind of surprised me like because you can like change the stuff and there's like an extra arm and all that and it's it's cool I mean it's cooler than I thought it was since I know I didn't pay a lot for this and I know it's not it's not like high high super quality material I don't know what I'm saying but anyways um this is the light figure and yeah it's not gonna focus because you know my my Ooh, my camera is just stupid like that but anyways it looks like this and it's it's cool I'm actually glad that I finally unboxed it because it took me so long I think I had it here hanging on the wall for like three or four years something like that 
I think. It was for my first convention. Um, or my second. Oh, I, I don't know. Times fly by and it goes so fast, so I don't I don't remember. Um, anyways, also my new background, which is actually the other side of where I normally film, but I just kind of wanted to show you guys like what posters are hanging around here. I tweeted about this, but you can really, well you could see, but there were a lot of pictures, so um, I'm just gonna show you. Uh, it starts here, so we have like the artwork here that I love from Psycho. It's really good. I really like the Vadakam on one. It's really nice. And this one too. And this one. I, it's just all good. So this one, the Attack on Titan one. This, this. And then we have like uh, Film of the Alchemist, Film of the Alchemist, Attack on Titan, Pokemon, because I just needed something in that corner. And then we have my free posters that my brother doesn't like. So, <laughs> and then we have the other side, which you have seen in my videos. So, that's the other side. And yeah, lots of stuff. Don't mind my laundry bag. <laughs> but um, yeah. Anyways, Nisekoi, Fate Zero. Kiroko, Hunter x Hunter, I really like this one, it's so, it's so good, <laughs> but yeah, that one with he's so kind of phantom troop, then my bleach poster, which was on the wall, there, in that shrine thingy, um, and then we have more Hunter x Hunter, I'm so glad I found posters, <laughs> I'm so thankful, um, Edward, and Madoka and Science Gate and random Pokemon um, keychains. <laughs> no idea why I keep them in that plastic either. They're worth nothing, but I like it like that. So yeah. And then we have Kyoko, Generation of Miracles, and free another free poster. So yeah. And the other ones I just kind of put in a other room. So, yeah, look what I've done with my boxes. Oh god, I'm moving way too much in this video. Uh, uh, oh no, you can't really see this, can you? But yeah, all my boxes are over here now. At least the ones that are important, I guess. And we have Edward in the shrine. So yeah, I totally messed up my position of my webcam or you know camera it's kind of it's it's a webcam but yeah kind of messed it up so yeah anyways um i will be watching cowboy bebop and welcome to the nhk soon um but i kind of forgot that i still had to finish bacano so <laughs> i'm still at episode six of bacano and i have it on dvd so i'm gonna finish that first so i'm finally done with that i i just i've always wanted to see it i just kind of forgot about it since it's like all the way down on my hummingbird list since i haven't updated it yet and um yeah i, I just need to watch bacano because oh i just need to finish that <laughs> anyway so that's kind of like a update of what i've been up to and what changed here and yeah, you guys know I'm busy, so I upload whenever I can, uh, which is still like pretty regular now, <laughs> and I'm happy about that. But um, yeah, there's a new season coming up as well, so and there's like final impressions that I'm gonna do for a certain anime, not for all of them, but like for the ones that I just really want to talk about. So I will probably do like a part one and two again um when most of it is finished and probably talk about it with Mian on double team as well and probably somewhere else as well so there's gonna be a lot of videos about that but um maybe i can do like my favorite final impressions like the the favorites favorite endings i don't i don't know what i'm saying anymore <laughs> anyways um i hope you enjoyed this video um like i said next season is coming so um, you'll know what I'll be watching then too. I will make videos about that. You will see that anyway. So <laughs> I'll keep you updated on Twitter and all that. Um, so make sure to follow me and um, 
yeah, that's it. Let me know in the comments, whatever. If you have any questions or anything, you can just leave whatever you like. And I will be back soon. Bye.